Good morning. Right, recently I've been uh, having to buy some output transistors. And, uh, well, I've bought a load. I've bought literally loads. And I wanted some 1969s and I wanted some um, uh, 2509s and I wanted various other bits and bobs. But anyway, where do you buy them from? So I've been looking on China, AliExpress, sellers from UK, eBay and places like that. Obviously, I've got a load of reclaimed ones. Um, loads. Who hasn't? Got some genuine 1969s genuine um whatever they are mrf 475s anyway so i bought a load of fakes i believe are fakes 2509s 1969s i mean look clearly fake clearly fake 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 well these ones you can clearly see i've had all the yeah, can we skin on that finger? Anyway, um, you can clearly see where all the uh, the original writing has been scratched off and new print stuck on top. AliExpress, fakes. Uh, eBay, fakes. eBay, fakes. eBay, fakes. <laughs> eBay, fakes. Don't even know what these are meant to be. But anyway, the fakes. Now, down here, all genuine. These are all genuine NECs, Mitsubishi's, uh, whatever that is, RS components. And down here, ooh, well, there you go. Genuine 1969s, fake 1969, genuine 1969. Well, actually, that's not a fake. It's actually an Eliflow. It's actually an Eliflow device, uh, which was stamped up by um, a good friend of mine. And sold as uh, as 1969 equivalents, and they do actually work. So if you see any of those, 04A 1969s, they are actually Ellie Flow, and they work really well. They're obviously genuine, genuine, genuine. Anyway, point of the video is, got all this crap out of here. Not those, no, not them. They're actually not uh, MPN, so I can't just stick them in. And I mean. Um, BCE, BEC, whatever they are. Can't stick them in and try them because I end up <laughs> burning my finger. Um, so how do you test all these fakes? Right. Your K63. Took out the output transistor and uh, just soldered in one of these. It's the... Uh, It's just a three pin plug off a uh, PC fan. Nothing major. Solder it in. Jobs are good in. Right. So here we go. There's my little power meter I'm using today, which is uh, an Amtron, uh, I don't know, some vintage old thing. There's the uh, socket. This is the original tranny transistor. For you uh, uh, non-British speakers, tranny. This is the final for all you Americans. This is an NEC 2SC 1909 out of this radio. One-handed, I'm going to blow myself up and I'm going to stick it in. Yep. I'll key up the microphonic device. There you go. Just over five watts. Ooh, where is it? There it is. So there you go. That works. Place that to one side. So I can go through any of these devices and see if they work. This is a brand new 1307. Brand new. Should work. When it's in properly. So I'll have to... Uh, Kiss it with my legs. Yeah, whatever. Well, it did work earlier on. 
Anyway, I've uh, we'll buggered up there, haven't I? Um, 1306. Brand new 1306. I think where it is, I think I've actually, uh, there you go. So, that's just a quick way of testing what works, what doesn't work. Let's try 1307 again. Hmm. There you go. Sorry, there you go. Look. There you go. So it is working. It's just not in the uh, in the holder very well. So what it is, I want to try all these fakes. So I got this. Uh, Two five oh nine. And uh, it's meant to work. I think I've actually bent my holders. There you go. Look at that. Wow. Yeah, that works. Loads of power. Another one. Wow, look at that one. Wow. Let's try one of these. Let, let's try this Ellie Flow. Off my mate. Let's, uh, let's 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 not blow it up. Let's see if I can get it in the actual uh, in the actual unit first. There you go. Look at that. There you go. Alley flow works. So pretty much you can test all your trannies, transistors, not your pills, because pills are little white things that you take with water, usually for headaches and stuff like that. Uh, 1969 There you go Real easy to check. So now I'm going to try some of these fakes these ones Again There you go fake the look fake but it does produce rf there's another one from the same batch fake now these ones you can't even, can't even see the writing under that good there you go look at that look how blatantly fake we'll plug it in But it produces RF. That's the thing. The fake, but they do produce RF. Now, I don't know what good they are. There's another one. This is not in properly. I need to wiggle it. There you go. So... They're blatantly fakes. These are the same part number, same batch number as the ones you've just seen transmitted. Absolutely nothing. 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 These have not even been fitted. But those ones, not them, them ones are there. Them ones worked. These ones don't. 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 None of these do anything. Yet they meter out and show as transistors. Put them on an ESR, they actually show as a working transistor. But they don't. So uh, there you go. Anyway, quick check. Make sure I'm still working. 2166. Good old faithful. There you go. 2166 working. Um, another 2166. Don't ask about the red dot. It's not the same one. There's the other one. Look, there's a new one. Well, a really old one. Look at that. Vintage. Vintage. Must be 1980s. 
there you go four watts these are finals for our american cousins these are four watt transistors which believe it or not do uh, just over four watts i suppose if i put it inside a cobra 29 and peaked and tweaked it i'll be getting about 125 watts out of it yeah daft lads anyway there you go brand new 1306 i'm gonna drop it in there boom there you go so that's the way i i test my transistors just to prove there's the original one 1909 here's another 1909 well used legs missing i'm just cramming it in there you go five watts 1909 1974 there you go 1974 there you go 1974 uh 2078 another common common device look at that six watts just over six watts from a 2078 here's another 2078 There you go, 2078. I can pick any of these. I can pick any of these whatsoever. I can pick any of them. They're all the same uh, uh, base collector emitter or base emitter collector. I'm not sure which way around they are. Can't be bothered to work it out, but they're all the same. Now, of course, some transistors like the uh, 2312s, that Cobras, and these... <laughs> yeah we know they're going to be fakes look at that we know it's going to be a fake but two three one twos they are actually cross-legged uh, a bit like the mrf 477 uh, which burnt my finger earlier on um they're actually cross-legged two of the legs are crossed over compared to a 1969 so you're not going to have example base collector emitter that'll be uh base emitter collector or you know um emitter base collector i don't know i don't know about getting the spec up can't be asked uh english terminology for i'm not bothered um in here i've got a load more i've got a load more brand new 2166s uh 2166 these ones i haven't even tried yet I've not even got around to these and all, all my little drivers these are all pulls out of that's a radios. What's that? No, that's a 2078. Not even straight in the legs yet, or took the solder off. But there you go. So, moral of the story. Uh, there isn't any, really. Um, get a radio that actually transmits. Fit yourself a little uh, fan connector off any old PC. I've used this one because obviously I've got Black goes to Ground, Red goes to um, Source, and the um, Yellow goes to, uh, yeah, whatever. They just look pretty, really. Um, and then, yeah, just get all your transistors, get your fakes, line them up, get a little power meter. It is, it is calibrated, by the way. Um, and just try them and you'll be surprised yes a lot of these are fakes they're from um uh, aliexpress they're fake they're from ebay they're fake they're fake they're all fake but these ones actually produce a bit of rf not a lot but a bit so you'll find on a meter an esr one of these little uh, gizmos. Get them off eBay for next to bugger all. About a tenner. That's all they are. About a tenner. Get them off eBay. You'll actually meter out these. 
as an MPN transistor with a high gain. Your meter these are as an MPN transistor with a not very good gain. But to the Chinese, that's good enough for them. It works. Same with these. These all meter out as MPN transistors. They all meter out as an actual working transistor, which they probably are in the right device with the right numbers on them they probably were a device for something they could be voltage regulators you know they, they could be amplifiers they're not necessarily rf devices these are rf transistors rf amplifiers these don't know what they are but they do produce rf <laughs> these ones especially did actually work um, and I just keep them because they do work. I'm never going to use them, but it proves the point that the the, the, the fakes and they do work. Um, Ellie Flow definitely works, hundred percent works. Um, but yeah, so there you go, folks. If you're going to buy fakes, if you're going to buy fakes, don't expect them to work. Really, don't expect them to work. Um, look for the manufacturer or the retailer or the seller or you know wh wh wherever you're looking that has them that look they look genuine they've got to look genuine I mean yeah we we could see that's a fake but genuine 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 they look different they're actually genuine Mitsubishi 19, uh, 1969s See, they look different. These three especially. But they are genuine. So there you go, folks. <clears throat> 18 minutes of your life wasted with me babbling on. Your K63, by the way, if anybody's interested. Your K63. PC fan connector. Genuine pulls from radios. Tested and working. Brand new 1969s. Some of them. And all my fakes. There you go. Don't be a mug like me and buy fakes. Buy genuine. Pay the price. Get genuine. Get results. Buy fakes. Yeah. Lose your money. Or put a claim in. So AliExpress. Be very, very careful what you buy from AliExpress. Also, there's a few sellers in eBay, UK sellers. I actually bought some of these looking things. These. Off a guy called Nico. Nico Electronics. Now, I've had some really good stuff off him in the past. Really good stuff. Unfortunately, the ones he's recently sent me are fakes. Um, they've actually been returned, so they're not these. But they look exactly like those same batch number exactly the same batch number but the fake so nico if, if you watch this video you're selling fakes these look like fakes they're fakes they're all fakes 100 percent fakes stevie wonder could even see their fakes look at that you can even see where they've sanded off the outer and then stamped the fake stamp on the top. Anyway, there you go. 20 minutes nearly gone of your lives. Have a good day. 73, etc, uh, etc. Et blah, 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 blah.